So oftentimes we look on social media to see what's happening in our community. And once in a while, there's a post that kind of stops us in our tracks. For me, it was this post, James talking about his grandfather, who he lovingly calls Gramps, crafting flower arrangements after he lost the love of his life. So we paid him a visit in Hazel Park. He put out with me for 58 years. This is a snapshot of EJ and Barbara on their wedding day. A young love led to a long and happy marriage, and together the duo loved gardening, planting flowers year after year. So when Barbara passed last year, EJ wanted to do something. And because age makes it harder for him to get around, he started crafting bouquets. Lots of them. I think she would love what he's been doing. The plan is to sell some of them or to decorate his lawn with them come spring. And look, I know some people might say this isn't news, and that's fine, and quite frankly, it's fair. But it is a story about someone who loved deeply and then lost that love and is scrambling to try to fill that void. And I think that's something that kind of resonates with all of us.